You go to get spices to make your favorite recipe for dinner and all your spices fall out. I'm going to give you a simple solution to fix this and stick around to the very end for a steak recipe that will make your mouth water. Hey everyone, Angela with Life and Oils with Joy here. I'm going to show you a simple way to organize your spices. Please stick around to the end of the video. I will show you a delicious steak recipe like you saw me trying to do in the beginning of the video. Here is my updated spice kit rack. I bought this on Amazon for about $40. It holds all of my spices, and I know that if it fills up, then I need to stop buying spices because I don't have room for any more. I know that when I run out of like these plastic ones, I'll probably buy glass just so everything's a little bit more cohesive and matching. I did put a little owl right here. My daughter bought this for me with her own money, so I thought that was a cute little add-on for now, at least while there's not spices in there. I found this really cute print at the home decorating store, and I added pictures of each of my kids so I can change that out um, throughout the year. And then um, one of my favorite parts is down here. This shelf we had originally intended to put up here, but we couldn't get it hung right. So I turned it upside down and added these three owl pots with the little succulents in them. And then this basket here, my mom got as a birthday gift. It's supposed to be a pot holder, but instead it holds my Alexa device perfectly. She didn't want it anymore, she gave it to me, and I think that turned into a happy accident. And then of course the last thing I have here is my utensil holder. So there you go, my spice wall as I call it. And I'm very happy with how it turned out. Now stick around for that steak recipe that I promised. So this was my spice cabinet. I had everything on these shelves, I had a third shelf, and every time I would go get a spice, you know, a whole bunch of them would fall down. So this is what I did instead of the spices. I have all my supplements. So that is my new spice cabinet. Oh, and I saved the lids to old prescription bottles. So when we're giving our vitamins, I just put one out for each kid. I put all their vitamins in it and they Thank you for sticking around and now here is that steak recipe that I promised you. It is from a blog called The Rising Spoon and it's a really easy recipe. Pink Himalayan salt, black pepper, you can add your own steak seasoning if you want. We are completely out because I used it up on this recipe. Butter and then of course you want to use a cast iron skillet. I will link, a, um, I will link the blog post below for you. If you liked this video, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button below to get my next video. You can also follow me on Instagram and Facebook as Oils with Joy. And thank you for watching. I hope you have a happy day and a life with joy.